Dear Art Diary, I have been a slacker. I have let my personal emotional imbalances dictate how awful my days are and I have been living like a leaf. You know, that whole blowing in the wind thing. It's not all bad news though. I have been doing those warm-up sketches every day. Well, most days. And I can't really tell if I'm getting better. But I do know I should be drawing more, but I don't. Also, it rained a lot this week and I ate too much. Okay, so what's going on? Well, way back early this year, I used to review the drawings that I did that week and give myself a bit of a critique. I stopped doing that in January because things kind of just piled up and I got lazy, to be honest. But lately, I've been wanting to try it again and this time with a slightly different format. This time, I'm going to try setting a goal and at the end of the week, I'll review if I was able to achieve that goal or challenge and how it went. With this format, I hope I can encourage others to try setting your own challenges as well and see how you go. Of course, it might not be for everybody, but setting goals and challenges and achieving them is something I find very hard to do because I tend to give up easily. And because I get overwhelmed before I even start the goal or challenge, I get to a state where I feel I can't do anything. All of this starts to become a habit and over time has set my expectations to fail even before I give it a chance. Because that's just what I come to expect from myself. Sound familiar? <laughs> well, self-discipline for me is a super hard skill to do, but I do believe somewhere deep inside that it is something that can be worked on. I've just stopped putting in the effort over the years. So that's what I'm going to do today. I'm going to start putting a little, a little bit more effort. I'm not sure how long the series will go for, but I do want to aim for the next three months to start with. So I got the idea for the first goal after buying a cheap sketch pad from the kids section at the local supermarket. I've got no idea why I bought it because I have plenty of other empty or half finished ones just lying around but it was just sitting there staring at me and in the back of my head it felt like a bargain so I bought it. At the time when I bought it, it made me happy so here it is. <laughs> I'm going to make this the worst, to make it, to set my expectations in reality I'm going to call this sketchbook the worst sketchbook I have ever owned. and But that's not this week's goal though. But I am going to use this worst sketchbook I've ever owned to start with. The goal for this week is to draw three heads in it each day this week, not including the weekend. So that's five pages of head drawings. I know what you're thinking because I thought the same. Big deal. I'm always drawing heads. What's different? And the answer is nothing really. <laughs> This is the starting week, so I want to make the barrier to entry a little bit easier on myself, but making it challenging because I have to draw three of them on one page. So that's the reason why I have set this goal. In a way, it's to start fresh with a sketchbook because it's the worst one. I can relax on the perfectionism a little bit. Um, I'm building on the skill of consistency and self-discipline that I mentioned earlier. I'm also building the skill of perseverance and patience, pushing to do more than one head when I know I'm going to wish I didn't say I would do three on one page. That's the challenging part this week. And I want to try and get these heads looking better without spending too much time on them. And lastly, I want to work on some basic lighting or shading and line weights in these little head sketches. So this is a quick video to introduce the series and I invite you to try out your own challenge this week. You can have the same as mine or you can set your own. Um, just find something that you want to work on and give it a shot. If you do, please tell me what you're going to do. Sometimes telling someone else makes it easier to push yourself. So next week I'll have the week's worth of sketches and do a bit of a critique review and then set up next week's challenge to achieve. Now who knows, maybe this worst sketchbook will have the, some of the best few pages by the end. Anyway, that's it for this video. I do hope to see you next time and see how it all goes. And let's, let's not give up and let's keep drawing.